Hello, welcome back to our Asteroid Base Let's Play. This is episode 7. Last time, we built a load of bottles for some artistic reason, and since then, I've finished them off, adding a bit of extra colour to the bottles themselves, and stuff like that, just make it feel just a little bit more finished than it did before. I've also added all this um, guff round here, because this was- oh! This, this was all a little unfinished. Now there's a wonderful little welcoming biome all of its own in a bottle just there. Plus a sign, the all-important sign. And there's the startings of an elevator down to the colony, but it's not really working properly at the moment. There are things to um, consider, which I haven't done yet. So in this episode, what we're going to do is we're going to add a Wild West element to our asteroid base. I've scouted out a new asteroid over to the east, which we'll go and have a look at. And there's going to be saloons and things like that, because they've just added Nova Kid um, villagers um, to, the, um, to the game in Starbound 1.1, which will add a kind of Wild West element. I also want to make a big Hollywood-style sign. Um, also, um, something I've done um, tweaked since previously, and this is um, something that was uh, mentioned in, in, in the comments of a video a while ago, is why don't I make this room themed around science rather than uh, kitchen furniture, because then it looks like whoever's the tenant here is going to be studying the asteroid. So let me just call the tenant. There he is! It's... Oh, thank you. Thank you for your bog roll. Um, it's a scientist with kind of three ears, so it's like a bug scientist, a mutant bug scientist. A very cheerful one, by the looks of it. All very cool. Uh, right, okay, so I'm just going to take the shuttle now, so we can go to our asteroid. And this is the um, a little shuttle bay that I made ages ago. Uh, I'm, just, I'm, I'm letting in the baddie. Sorry, scientist girl. <laughs> so if you go over to the east, there's... Oh, <laughs> there it is. This, for geographical purposes, is... Oh, it's taking a while to load. And um, this is just east, northeast of our garden. By the looks of it, some... Um, um, our alpaca is having a bit of a fight, is in the water, prick. <laughs> uh, there's also some new um, fluffler which um, haven't actually grown yet, so that'll happen soon. Okay, let's just go back to our new asteroid. Um, it is night time, so you can't see shit. <laughs> so yeah, we, need, we basically need to build on here, it's not actually that big, but I think it'll do. Um, not quite sure how I'm going to do this yet. Uh, but first of all, I think what we should do is go to find a Nova Kid village. Uh, now, before I started this episode, I did actually go um, and scout out a place. I just, I just went, uh, I read up that apparently the villagers are scattered randomly around. It's totally random where they are. Um, so I picked this planet as the snow planet, and literally the very first planet I chose had one on it. So I got incredibly lucky. Um, you, you know, um, your mileage may vary. I don't know what's going on there. This doesn't look like the same planet. Oh, I think it is. It must be the same planet. I just don't remember those people there. Okay, so I'm going to head off to the east. Oh yeah, I remember him. If I head off to the east, there should be, right here, a Nova Kid Wild West Village. With lads around the place. Um, a crying, lighting up Nova Kid guy. Oh, it's also morning. Thank God for that. Um, just get my fishing rod out. Hey! <laughs> See my fishing video for details. Oh, look at that! He's got, a, he's got an old revolver! And it's got a hat! It's got a nice little Rimworld hat. You're feeling lucky, punk! <laughs> he said, shooting his bloody gun. He's a good lad. Ah! Look at this lad! He's got a sphinxful Arvis in his mush. Oh, look at the furniture! Look at the- look at it. well, okay, so the furniture- that's just a bookcase. <laughs> but look at the- look at the art! It's Wild West art! There's a cow! There's a wonderful, wonderful cow! And there's also oh, there's all steampunky type stuff as well. There's a bit of a steampunk um, tinge to this. I do want to make something themed around steampunk at some point. Uh, probably the next episode. Uh, yeah, I'll have that. So I do want to steal a lot of their furniture. Um, they're not going to like this, are they? So I'm going to have to plan myself very carefully. I think first of all, what I'll do is I'll grab the safe stuff that's out, that comes out of boxes and things. Because they don't give a shit if you do that. It's only when you start ripping the furniture off the walls, then they start whining. I love these beds with cow duvets. Couvets? I really w must have someone. In fact, will they notice if I take this now? No, they won't. They didn't see a thing. It's the perfect crime. I have stolen their cow bed. They are none the wiser. Emboldened by this, I'm going to steal their safe. Yes. And some of that. We're going to have to have to put a lot of wood and stuff around... Uh, I'm, not, I'm not even sure what we're going to do yet. It's going to be it's going to be Wild Westy type buildings. Cabin roofing, I can craft anyway. In fact, in fact, why don't? Why don't I do this the old, well, the new-fashioned way of just scanning things? 
And because that means hopefully that'll just add, add it to my pixel printer and I can get as much furniture as I want without thieving it. Yeah, that'd be nice. That'd be good. Uh, lots of bottles. I believe I can craft them anyway. Uh, there's a bar. There's a bar chair. A saloon sign. Marvellous. What's this? A prop? Oh, hello! <laughs> it's a mate! He was using it as a disguise. How very fairground. How very charming. Ah. There's, there's even cells. There's been thieves around these parts lately. We don't take kindly to stealing. Uh, they might be onto me, but at the moment they don't seem too ba um, bad about it. Oh, look at this! Oh, I definitely need some... Oh, hello. Uh, let's let's help out. Oh, there's a bog! Right at the very end of the colony, someone just got in for a piss. You can just about see their glowing head through the, the little moon door. Excellent. So, uh, yeah... I think I'll I think I'll stick to scanning, but I do kind of want stuff without having to. Yeah, fuck it, I'm just gonna steal everything. Ha <laughs> ha! The blacksmith's not gonna know what hit him. Sorry, mate. <laughs> I have I'm a blacksmith and I have some fine-looking gear to sell. You're in for a surprise. <laughs> right, I think I better just get some more stuff. Meanwhile, back on the colony. Um, so I need to do a few things. Um, first of all. Cabin roofing. I've got a bit of this, but I might as well just craft a bunch. Um, this will get me 30, so eh, let's get 600. This will be lovely. Um, I've got loads of wood. Um, I think that's going to be a, a definite um, base material for most things. And pixel printer. Let's have a look at the art and stuff like that. I've got loads of stuff now. Bloody hell. I've been scanning shit loads of stuff. Hide lottle stuff. Picture stands. Uh, I'm sure there's got to be stuff that I saw before. Uh, I don't know. Oh, here we go. Frontier stuff. So it's all this frontier gear. Um, yeah, frontier. Oh, grandfather Clark. Oh, yeah. Oh, there's the Mushi painting. Got to be lot, lots of them. Of course, this is all stuff for later on. Actually, I want to pump. I want to pump. There we go. <laughs> so I want stuff for later on. But let me just get a few of these things. Frontier door. Yeah, that's good. This is for the actual proper building itself, so I might as well get them now. Um, all this stuff, yeah, all that can wait. Although lighting, yes, I will need lighting. I don't think I actually scanned any lighting. I don't think there was anything particularly... Uh, traditional wooden post. Made of a very metallic looking wood, admittedly. Um, torch stand. Oh, here we go, frontier lamppost. Um, looks exactly like all the other lampposts, but never mind. Alright. So let's go and build stuff. What's that going on over there? Oh no, I think I've... Uh, I think I've run out of space. Uh, um, <laughs> get rid of that, I'm not going to use that, am I? Oh uh, no, all this kitchen furniture. Uh, oh, everything's just spurting out all over the place. One, oh, I need a wagon wheel. Oh, I need that. Oh, I need, oh God, I've got everything. Get rid of the perfectly generic item, don't need that. Uh, don't want that either. There we go. I think I've picked everything up. So, we need to go to our new place. Ah, la, la, la. I need some moss. Ah, la, la. I changed this junction at some point, so the lifts didn't keep on disappearing. Uh, but yeah, I need a new sign here that says something to the right here. Uh, well, I can put like maybe like frontier, maybe the wild west. I also need a sign because if I'm going to do a Hollywood style sign, yeah, move, 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 move. I'll need some material. Probably just use something like silver block. But I want to be. Fuck. <laughs> I want to be. Oh no, I'm steaming like a big turd. In fact, I could put some... If I put the sign up here, uh, and then I can make all the... Um, I can make a kind of clingy Wild West, where all the buildings are clinging to the side. Like something out of sci-fi. Uh, like this game is, I guess. So that doesn't make a lot of sense. Right, where do I start? Right, here's what we're going to do. So I've changed my mind about the metal. It's now going to be smooth metal, which is fairly cheap, and I've got lots of it. So... What I want to do is have it like the Hollywood sign, so it has kind of like um, scrappy, shitty backings to it, so to hold the sign up. So if I use a right click and put this in the background, I kind of, I sort of have a thingy, a scaffolding. I was going to use that red scaffolding stuff um, that you get from various places, but I didn't really want it red because <laughs> it doesn't make a huge amount of sense that. So if you have something like, see, the H would be like that. I mean, it would probably be like too wide actually. Um, what am I actually going to write here? So this is Asteroid Prime. Wood. Ass wood. <laughs> Woody ass. Assy wood. Uh, that's it, yeah. 
Assy wood seems about right, because that's some um, eight letters. One, two, th that should just about fit. Okay, Assy wood it is. Ah, now here we go. Here's a problem, is that this is going to have to be in the foreground, I guess, without some boring ass jiggery pokery. Some boring Assy wood jiggery pokery. I'll just make it up in the air. <laughs> that's my solution to everything. Make it up in the air and not give a toss. Right, so, up. And how big is it? Oh, this is all. Oh, no, this isn't quite the right. No. <laughs> Can you see the exact point of that sentence? I just lost interest and thought, fuck it, I'll do it anyway. Yeah. Uh, okay, it'll do. Um, let's have a. Oh, this is inevitably not symmetrical. It's offset. Does that look alright? It doesn't. It's not brilliant, is it? Is there any other material I've got that would service in the same. Mm, no. Nah. Oh, I just don't like the um god damn it. I don't like the lack of symmetry, but that, that kind of looks that looks funky in a weird sort of way, so I think I'll keep it. Um tough is my considered opinion. Right, okay, let's just rid of this background, otherwise I'm not gonna be able to put the chains up. Uh, I have flattened this a little bit, but obviously I need to do a bit more. It's also romantic, isn't it? Snowing. Here we are, an asteroid base. In the height of summer, <laughs> well, autumn. Uh, okay, let me. Just, um, I'll, I'll finish off these letters and I'll get back to you. Otherwise, it's going to take forever. Okay, hooray for Assywood! Yeah, I did have to build an extension to the asteroid to fit it all on. Uh, I'll just light them up with some uh, prison spotlights. Uh, oh, that's all. The landscape's buggered there. Uh, let's put that there. This isn't the. Yeah, this is a bit piss. Uh, but so are you. There. <laughs> Sorry, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a bit mad now. I just spent so long doing this bloody thing. Look at that. It isn't even lit up properly. <laughs> just the very bottom of it is lit up. <sighs> okay, that's fine, though. Um, when it's daytime again, I'll have a look at that properly. And for now, I need to start building downwards, though. And we need to start building our first clingy Wild West shacks. I will have to build a shuttle docking thing up there at some point. Um, otherwise it's a bit silly. I mean, all that's, all the crafting table stuff is, of course, entirely temporary. <sighs> right, so let's build... Let's build a little... Let's build from the bottom up. Because um, that's strategy, that is. Because I foresee a lot of falling down, if I'm not careful. Uh, so these are, these are going to be small houses. I admit. And they're going to be clinging on for dear life. I need some more. I, I will need some support beams. I'll have to work out how to craft them. Hopefully, it's just a case of going to Pixel Printer and sorting that out, because uh, I, I want to make this as completely realistic as possible. As a Wild West village hanging off an asteroid can feel realistic. Um, the door's going to be. Uh, we have to work out some kind of corridor situation. Um, but for now, I think if I just hang on, let's have a. Let's pretend the door is here. We won't have to pretend soon because it's going to be completely real. Maybe too real. <laughs> okay. Um, yep. Yeah, I will reshape these a little at some point to make them more interesting. Yet again, though, to start with, we're just going to have a little box situation. Maybe some roofing as well. Uh, oh, blow me up. Bloody hell. Bloody hell. I don't think there's anything below us. I think I'll fall down to the plant if I'm, if I'm not careful. Okay, whatever. Um, I've got loads of those doors, haven't I? I crafted doors for days somewhere. <laughs> Yeah, I can never see these things in my inventory. Um, all I'm looking for is a door. There it is. It's confusingly... Yeah, whatever. There we go! <laughs> hey, we can welcome in the cowboys very soon. Hopefully, these will attract lots of cowboy Nova kids. Um, obviously, I haven't tried this out yet. Um, but let's... Yeah, well, I'll do it now then. Shall I? Yes. Right, put in a platform. And a light source. Um, this can probably stay... Let's just have a candle. <laughs> the, the tiniest light source possible. Now, we don't have any colony deeds, do we? Ah, right, okay. Let's go to the outpost then. Froggy, I'm back! Why do I call him Froggy? He's never actually been called Froggy, has he? He's, just, he's always been called Frog. Oh, never mind. Um, let's go for that. Six. I've got plenty, reasonable amounts of cash. Oh, steampunk! 
oh, I'll need some of that stuff for the next episode if I do what I uh, intend to do. Um, so, whilst I'm here, let's buy three of everything here as well. Uh, won't be a moment. Ah, here we go. I'm just being back to the flag, which I cleverly foresaw that I'd need. And it's daytime. Um, hooray for assy word again. Get rid of you. Don't want you. <laughs> there we go. That looks quite cool, actually. In a shitty sort of way. <laughs> um, although I could have... Oh, the W is annoying me. And the chain just goes up in the air for some reason. Oh, fuck it. <laughs> that is my considered opinion. Oh, there's also extra chain, but yeah. I'll tidy that up off camera. Right, okay, so let's some um, colony deed. Well, actually, first of all, we need to put some furniture in. So let's do our first cow bed. Um, what else? Um, steampunk, no, it's bloody steampunk stuff. And, yes, the moo picture. And the mooshy. Ah, there we go. Um, that probably is all we need, although I'm not quite sure. Because I think um, some tenants only get attracted if you have... Oh, there we go, that's fine. Although, to be fair, it doesn't have a cowboy hat. That's really annoying. I want a cowboy hat. Nah, fuck it. I'm sure there'll be others. Because um, I think you need a, you need a kind of theme furniture to cover 18 blocks for it to apply. Or But sometimes it can be as high as 30. Um, so you just have to either in experiment or cheat by looking at the wiki. Oh, he'll do for now anyway. Um, so I could also add a bit of extra stuff. I might put in this kitchen furniture in one of these houses over here. Um, because it kind of fits the Wild West theme a bit. It's a bit green for the Wild West. I think everything in the Wild West is covered in sand, so it's all yellow. Um, or wood. Or something, I don't know. Um, but that's a really bit of a, that's a pathetic little house. Um, I could really do with the support beams. Um, right, hang on. Oh, this is, this is, I should have, while well, I was at the outpost, I should have um, repaired this. Oh, ow, 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 ow. Uh, yeah. Why is he dressed like me? <laughs> He's gone now, anyway. Uh, right, support beam. What would that be under? It might not be under pixel printer, it might be under... I might have to go to just use a normal crafting thing, actually. Um, where would this be? Generic furniture? Oh, here we go. Yeah, it's under here. I could have actually done that back where I was then. Uh, wooden support. String and timber. Yeah, we're going to need lots of these. Oh! <laughs> Takes a while. Da, 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 da. And does it even fit in my inventory? Yes, it does. Just got a little bit of space. Oh, it's yeah, there it is. Uh, right, well, I might as well just beam back, mind I? Um, in fact, I should have listened to this. Oh, I should have just done that. Should, oh, I could. Actually, I couldn't because the um, the flag doesn't work as a teleporter. There it is, Wild West. Wee plop. There we go. Hup. Hello, Boston. <laughs> You've got to learn to lock the door. Piss off! This is why you need a, I need a proper cowboy, so um, they can defend themselves. Um, right. Ow! Hang on. Hang on, lads. I'm being attacked. See, I told you right at the start of the series that they were going to be a pain in the arse. See, already that, that makes a bit more sense. Okay, so I'll move on to the next house. It's coming along quite nicely, actually. I'm, I'm quite liking how this is coming out against all odds. Um, the support beams, for some reason, really help. I don't know why, but they really add to, add something to this, which I can't quite put my finger on. Um, oh, no, that's not quite. There, that, that should be big enough for the door now. And this is going to be a bit of a funny-shaped house, because why the hell not? Oh, I can't quite get to that top left bit. Uh, put in some background... Make sure that there's some cabin roofing on this, otherwise the whole enterprise is stupid. No, oh. <laughs> ish. Uh, get out! Get out of the house! It's not your house. Go back to your own house. I've, I've just furnished you with, I'm giving you the most incredibly furnished house in the world, and now you're just bloody getting in the way, as per usual. Ugh. Right, let's just do that. And that. That means I can get up to the corner. And it, hopefully, it means I can also add a little bit of roofing on as well. That's gonna. I'm gonna take all that out, obviously. Um, so, who lives in a house like this, David? It's over to you. Right, chair. Mysterious plant thing. Another mushy picture. Good. Right, this. I've got. How many did I bloody well get? Ugh. Uh, what's that? That's um. Is that a steampunk one? It kind of is. I can, I'll, I'll leave that to my um steampunk stuff. I think it's um. Be a bit excessive putting it here. Uh, is this really? 
Steam... Is this really Novakid furniture? Well, there's a safe there, so that, that's definitely Novakid. Although, that might end up attracting a merchant. Ah, water pump. That's it. It's got to be... I think it's got to have Frontier in the title for it to count. Uh, surprisingly, I've got less stuff than I thought. Uh, ah! No, let's put the tenant deed in. See what happens with this. I haven't actually put a tenant deed in over there yet. Hello? Oh, there's no light source. Right. Um, well, I, as low as I am putting a bloody lamppost here, I'm going to do it anyway. Um, so the mushy picture needs to fuck off. There we go. That can move over to there. And the lamppost can go into there. And, hey presto, probably a Nova Kid. It's a Nova Kid chef? Come back! Don't fall to your death, you great daft duck's egg. It is a chef. Um, selling a quiche. Let's buy a quiche. <laughs> Why not? So is that just a coincidence or is that actually supposed to be a... Ah, who cares. Um, I do hope you enjoy the food. Ah, whatevs. Okay, let's put in... That. Let's see if we can get another one. Oh, that's a glitch. Glitch? Get out of my frontier house. You prick. Um, I don't think there's enough frontier stuff. I don't think those tools count. Um, there's another safe. Um, that's not frontier stuff either. Oh, there's no room for anything. No, uh, poopy. Let's just put some there. Uh, I, c I can't because I need... Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay, it's not going to be a f bloody cowboy. None of the others are cowboys. Oh, there we go. Um, for some reason it's now... Uh, that, that might... It might all be just be coincidences, this. This might not actually... Any any of it might not actually be uh, Frontier Furniture um, attracting stuff. I don't know. Ugh. Well, it's not looking too bad so far. We need a way up. So let's um, stick to the rickety thing that we've got going. So let's just do a kind of um, staircase to the stars. Um, it's not perfect. But none of it is. Ah, that's okay, actually. Let's, I'm going to take this stuff out, because I don't seem to be needing much more of this. There we go. This is so dangerous. <laughs> uh, ah, yeah. But it's a nice little community, just hanging out, quite literally. So I was going to kind of, like, finish it there. Um, but then I thought, fuck it, let's go for broke. So, as well as, like, tweaking this round here, I've started um, digging into the... Well, I've, I've finished. <laughs> um, I've dug into the heart of the asteroid and created loads of new rooms for us. Uh, I've also, I kind of like concluded it with a kind of platformy chain type affair. Uh, that's basically because I was getting bored. I just wanted to, <laughs> just wanted to finish it. Uh, but it's all looking quite, rather nice. Um, I've also um, gone and had a look at furniture, the furniture situation in the um, pixel printer. So now I've got loads of saloon stuff that I scanned ages ago. And I've all arranged it so now I can. Well, now I'm going to make a little saloon here. I think that's the um, the logical thing to do. Um, I still think there's more stuff buried in the um, in my inventory, but we'll start with a. T there's a bar somewhere, isn't there? There should be a bar. There is a saloon. Oh god, that's huge. Uh, that's fine. <laughs> have have a double decker saloon, uh, the best kind. Uh, let's not actually. Let's um, put in a couple of tables. Uh, huh. Uh, that's not great. Um, and also grandfather clock. Uh, maybe somewhere else actually. Um, do that. Hup. Oh, this is going to be the best bar in the world. Although I, I really kind of like do feel like I need some bottles in the background, but I haven't actually sorted that out. Um, so, uh, I don't know. For now, what I'll do is go over to platforms. Later on, I can put some bottles in, in the background. But not now, because I can't be fucked. Um, put it like that. Right, okay, so let's put in Frontier Wagon Picture. A nice little bar, this. I know what we can do. There, you can have a bottle of fly. Delicious fly. Yeah. Well, whatever. Let's get a tenant in. Let's hope there's a barkeep. Probably not. Oh, proper cowboy! Finally! Oh, none of the others have hats. You don't have a hat. You don't have hat. Oh, I said one of them does have a hat, but it's the wrong kind. It's Sheffy Hat McHatterson, who's a prick <laughs> with grim inevitability. Uh, so there's two more rooms over here as well. Um, I guess we just shove in any old tut. Let's put that in. So there's a hat coat. Actually, the coat rack should go in here, shouldn't it? 
since it is the saloon slash bar. Plus, are these, is that booze? That's booze. Oh, that's a drinks cabinet. That actually does, is supposed to go in here. Uh, there's not much room left. Um, uh, okay, let's, let's be a bit subtle about this. Just rip everything off. Put that in there. And then we can squeeze in one enormous chair. Put that there. Uh, oh dear. Maybe that's not good enough. Well, some things... I, I need to rearrange this place. Okay, I feel that's a bit of a smarter layout. I've also rejigged this. So let's bung in a... T who? What do you want? <laughs> let's bung in a tenant. Please be another cowboy. Yes, it is. A uh, hairier cowboy. Good. I like a hairy cowboy. Right. Okay, so next room. Um, I've lost one of my clocks. Uh, th there we go. Um, this is going to be a fairly generic one. I could have put just another bloody saloon bar in there. But that might be a bit... I, that's all I've bloody well got. Okay, might have to be another one. Then. This can be the storeroom. Uh, yeah, a nice little storeroom. Uh, with some with ancillary table for larks and that. Uh, and even another one of those. It's just like bloody make two of everything. I think I'm, I think I might well have done. Um, that should really go there. There we go. Feels a lot better. So this is just going to be a, a, a like a, a a rival bar, I guess. Another cowboy. Oh, this is much more like it. Now there's cowboys everywhere. I feel like we're actually achieving something. And meanwhile, this. Now we really have run out of stuff. So let's just bug in some medieval stuff. A wooden end table. It's going to be furniture for days here. This is going to be like room of chairs. All facing in weird, incorrect directions. <laughs> also, that torch is terrid. Yeah. No, uh, whatever. Shelf! There. <laughs> also, a oh, that's a steampunk thing. I don't want to use a steampunk thing. Right. Okay. I don't know if I can press the right button. This can be the last one. And presto. One fine... Yeah, this is another bloody cowboy hat woman. How come all these are cowboys and nobody else is? Ugh. Obviously, this isn't enough frontier furniture. Um... Okay, maybe it's just the saloon stuff. Oh, who cares? <laughs> anyway, I think this is this is actually looking quite nice now. Um, what whatever I called it, assy wood. Ugh, dirty-minded prick. <laughs> right. Okay, so we'll stop here and we'll pick this up again next time when ow bollocks. When hopefully we'll do something steampunky as per all the furniture we got. I think that would be fun. So yep, subscribe for to be notified about future episodes in this series and other Starbound videos and a lot more besides. Uh, see you next time. Bye-bye.